hi welcome back to your new lesson in this lesson i'm going to show you load store addressing mode in a previous tutorial we had discussed that there are three types of addressing mode so the first addressing mode mode is pre-indexing with write back and the second one was a simple pre-index without any write back and the third one was a post indexing right so the arm instruction set provides different modes for addressing memory and these modes incorporate one of the indexing methods and we are going to discuss those methods into the detail so let's see uh, let's make in a table uh, of the three address three indexing mode and uh, let's say if we say here this is index mode and let's say here we have a data and uh, here let's say we have a base address and let's say here we have example once again i would like to um, explain you here let's say these are the memory location here is a uh, 0x 0 0 memory location and it becomes 0x 0 0 1 and this becomes 0x 0 0 0 2 0x 0 0 3 and this becomes 0x 0 0 4 and so on so what happens let's say if we load if we load the data from this address let's say from this address and the data is word aligned then it will load the data from next four conjective address then with this period th then with this pre-indexing mode we can automatically forward the data load with the next four or backward four okay so it depends how we are how we are referring this indexing mode so let's say if we have indexing mode with pre-index with write back pre-index plus write back in this case the data will be accessed from the memory uh, pro pro from the memory pointed by the base register and plus offset let me show you how let's say if I say you we have an instruction which says that LDR R0 and from the address R1 so this kind of um, this kind of LDR we have seen into the previous tutorial but let's see we have something like this R1 plus has 4 so what happened in this case you see this is the new term here we have added here so this is what I am referring about the indexing okay so the question is what will happen after the load register after the load instruction so the first question is whether the data will be loaded from this r1 uh, pointed by this uh, memory address pointed by this r1 or data will be loaded from the memory address pointed by r1 plus 4 so these all these things depends on the addressing mode what type of addressing mode we are referring so the very first uh, intuition while we are working with LDR with indexing mode if address is pointed and this is in between these two square bracket then what processor will do the compiler will first add the the content of these two values which is r1 and plus 4 then it will it will get the data from the um, the address of r1 and plus 4 and after that it will automatically it, it will automatically increase r1 with r1 plus 4 that is why this is known as a pre-indexing with write back that's when the pre-indexing pre-indexing refers that before loading from the memory address it will first perform this uh, arithmetic uh, operation that is the addition 
or it could be the subtraction also and after this arithmetic operation then it will load from the memory address and then finally it will write back write back means it will automatically increase this address here so in base address base address will automatically will be increased which will be the base plus offset okay so this base address will be base plus offset and the example could be a simple example let's say we have LDR R0 and R1 and has 4 okay so here this will not be the plus here in fact there would be a comma okay so here we have this instruction now let's say we have another um, example with a pre-index without any write back in this case what will happen it will again load from the memory address which is pointed by the base the base is R1 register and the offset and the offset is pointed by hash 4 since this is a positive so the overall memory would be R1 plus 4 the memory address would be decoded from R1 plus 4 and the base address would not be changed so there would be no change here since there is no write back here and uh, and uh, of course here uh, one more thing I had just missed pre-indexing with write backs takes here exclamation mark and uh, pre-index without write back will not take this exclamation mark so this can be written like this ldr r0 and with r1 and only has for without this exclamation mark and then finally we have here the post indexing and uh, in a post index in a post index it will load the data from the memory address the pointed by this base the base is R1 and there is no offset but the base address will change after the memory load uh, after the data loaded from the memory so the base will change to with base plus offset and the example of uh, this type of pre-indexing mode would be like this we have here LDR R0 and R1 and then here has 4 that's mean if this value is outside of this square bracket then this will indicate that this is case of the post index in a post index microcontroller or a CPU first load the data from the memory and the address would be the pointed by this R1 and after that it will automatically increase this R1 is equal to R1 plus 4 and so this is about the offset and we have discussed here this is the positive offset but but offset could be the positive or the negative it depends on how you are using so moreover we can say here is like that let's say we have here LDR R0 let's say with R1 and this could be the plus minus offset either uh, microcontroller ALU addressing uh, can jump into the forward direction or into backward direction so there is another question you might ask that how much so the question is how much it can go into backward direction or how much it can go into the forward direction so this is known as kind of the immediate right immediate value so the immediate addressing you can say here so in this immediate addressing kind of things it has 12 bit so the 12 bit you can say it's it's a 2 power 12 which is 4 MB so this is the 4 MB address which it can go um, it can go into any direction 
while decoding this offset. So the offset is defined by this 12 bit. Okay. So this is all about in this tutorial. In this tutorial we have learned about the load store addressing mode and uh, load store addressing modes in which the these are the three type of indexing mode we had discussed with an examples also and we have also discussed how much this can jump into forward and to and backward direction so thank you so much for watching this video please do not forget to subscribe